All right. Uh, let's simplify this third. Uh, so it's a division involving thirds. So when the denominator is irrational, right? Irrational number, irrational number uh, in the form of third. In the form of third. So we have our purpose here is to rationalize the denominator. Uh, how is it? Multiply with its conjugate, right? Uh, multiply with its conjugate. So, okay. So two square of five plus with three square of two. Uh, in order to rationalize the denominator, we have to multiply the uh, denominator with its conjugate. Uh, that's the purpose here. Two square of two. Plus with square of 5. Uh, what's the conjugate here? The conjugate for uh, this denominator here yeah, will be 2 square root of 2 minus with square of 5. Uh, just change the sign. Positive, become negative. So 2 square of 2 minus with square of 5. Uh, so you have learned that when you have conjugate. Uh, if you have square of A minus with square of B uh, with its conjugate, uh, with its conjugate square of B, you are getting A minus B, right? A minus B. Uh, so this is also one of the formula generate uh, for every set here. So for example, this one also the same. Uh, so if you multiply, you are getting, uh, this is not a pair of conjugate. This is not a pair of conjugate. Uh, so let's uh, multiply. So 2 times 2, so we have to patient when doing this, 2, 2 times 4, right? Square of 5 and square of 2 will become square root of 10, right? As you take the A and the B, you multiply square of 10, and followed by negative, uh, negative, positive, 2, 2, 2 times negative 1, negative 2, square of 5 and square of 5, you're getting the 5, uh, followed by this term, 3 times 2, have 6 square up 2 square up 2 definitely we're getting 2 positive negative negative positive 3 multiply negative 1 here you have negative 3 uh, square up 2 and square up 5 you have square root of 10 all right so i have done with the numerator okay let's look at the denominator uh, this is the way we rationalize the denominator you can see uh, if you, you can apply that formula faster so 2 times 2, you have 4 times 2, right? 2 times 2, 4. Square up 2, square up 2, you're getting 2. Okay, and this one, and the second one. So it will be negative, negative. 2 square up 2, 2 times negative 1, negative 2. Square up 2 and square up 5, you have square up 10. Uh, square up 2 and square up 5, you have square up 10. And for this also, positive. Positive uh, 2. Square up 5 times square up 2, square root of 10. Right? Right? Negative positive, negative square root of 5, square root of 5, you're getting 5. Uh, so now you can see that the third with its conjugate of thirds, you can see that this middle term is always cancelled out. Right? Always cancelled out. So, okay, let's look on top. We have what? Uh, so be careful, negative 10, right? Negative 10 plus with 12, right? Negative 10 plus with 12, 4, 4 square root of 10, right? Uh, 4 square root of 10 minus with 3 square root of 10. Just like 4a minus 3a. Uh, so 4 minus 3, you will have 1 square root of 10. So you're getting square root of 10 on top. So divided by, this will be, cancel off, negative 2 plus with 2, square of 10. So 4 times 2, 8. Right? 8 minus with 5. So after simplify, you are getting negative 10 plus 12. You are getting 2 plus square root of 10 over with 3. Right? Uh, over with 3. So if you see that, we already rationalized the denominator. It's already become a rational number here. So then this is the way we simplify uh, division involving uh, thirds. Right, that's all for this video.